morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Welcome to Verdict TV, and thank you for tuning into this channel. The news headline Campaigning for Kanu's prolonged detention won't get you pipeline contracts. IPOP tells Dokubo. Once again, you're welcome to today's news. And thank you for tuning into this channel. Kindly listen to the hand. The news details. The indigenous people of Biafra on Sunday berated the former Niger Delta militant leader Asari Dokubo for opposing the ongoing calls for the release of his detained leader Namdi Kanu. Dokubo, who was the leader of the Niger Delta People's Salvation Force, had in a chat with State House correspondents after a meeting with President Bola Tinobu last Friday in Abuja, urged the federal government to keep the activists who is standing trial for alleged treasonable felony and terrorism in prison. However, in a statement issued by its spokesman, Ima Powerful, IPOB warned the ex-agitator and other individuals to stop using Kano's name to curry favor in Asorok. The group alleged that Dokubo uh, for scheming to secure a contract for the protection of oil pipelines in the Niger Delta. The statement reads, Dokubo and others are campaigning for the continuous detention of Maz Namdikanu in DSS solitary confinement. But they forgot that militancy for monetary gains is in the same category as criminals and terrorists. Asari Dokubo, an ex-militant, um, an ex um a former Niger Delta militant leader of recent he has been making ill statements about the Igbos and come to think of it previously he was also a supporter of Biafra and not until one year and some months before he actually left the Biafra and stopped um supporting the movement. So and um we know that his grandfather is also an Igbo man so he also has Igbo blood in him, but he has decided to deviate from um, the and and he has decided to deviate and also um, leave his own people. And he's now an ex. Uh, he's now a Niger Delta man. So um, aside the Kubo, as we say in different ill statements, and because of these statements, the IPO people to have responded to him. So, um, Dokubo, when he had a meeting with, he had a closed door meeting with um, the president of Nigeria, President Tinubu. And after the meeting, he spoke with some journalists and there he made a statement that Namdikanu should not be released and um, because he should be charged for terrorism uh, because he's actually constituting um, nuisance in the society and people are killing themselves and the likes because of his movement so he said that Tinubu should not release Namdikanu for any cause and he also made a statement that anywhere he may meet the Igbo that the Igbo should be killed so all the statements the Kubo has actually made them previously so um the Igbo now replied that um by um the the IPOP members replied through its spokesman um Ima Powerful they want the they want the Asari Dokubo, the ex agitator to stop using Kanu's name to to um ask for favor in Asorok because Asari Dokubo now is not he's still having to focus on the oil bunkering and the likes that he's concerned with his own people. He's focusing on something else because now he's evolving in Nabikanu's case and Biafra, Biafra all the time. I think he's just doing all of this because he wants to gain favor and he wants to get closer to the president and he also wants some appointment you get or contracts so uh that's why he's doing what he's doing so the sport in my powerful said that uh 
other people are not suicidal Kubo are trying to use the name of Namdukano to get favor in Aso Rock because I don't see why he's um is against in the iPod so much like it is so evident like he cannot even keep it. he says anything at any time concerning iPod like you were not even part of them before like the way he's talking is like he does not even have any connection to do with them so um Asai Dokubo is trying to get so close and to get appointments because when he went for a meeting with um with Tinubu you should see how he actually felt at that period like he he has actually made it and the likes that people started talking that Asai Dokubo what he actually what he finally wanted he had finally gotten it because it's been a while he has been looking for how to get so close to the presidency so now he's saying um statements that are not supposed to be aired like statements that are not supposed to come out from your mouth he has been uttering it to the um ebos and the beer friends so we hope that he shuts his mouth uh, up because he is not also a saint for you to be an ex-militant that means you have even killed you have um you have bunkered you have um destroyed properties and the like so you are not a saint for you to be um condemning someone else so it's just like pot calling kettle black that's just his um the way we can call asari dokubo so what's your view concerning this news can you share your view in the comment section and don't forget to like and share and also click on the subscribe button to subscribe and the bell for more updates thank you